Welcome, Welcome back, B plus C family. family. Oh snap, oh snap, oh snap. Let's go this way. Bam, 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 right. bam. Oh my gosh, it's Friday, it's Friday, it's Friday, it's Friday. But it's not just any, any Friday. There's it's some not, gold. There's a lot of Disney cheese, man. There's a to lot. Catch up there's on. a lot of Disney stuff that's happened over the last yes. 48 hours since we've been in the park. On top of that, there's something new, new that we gotta go ahead and get to today. So the, the stream itself is there's gonna run a little so bit different. It's, it's prepared, it's catered for all of you guys. Pero con todo amor. Oh my gosh, I'm excited because we get to have a little new magic in the park today. Yay. We're excited. Some of you guys know, some of you guys have no clue, and some of you guys are just happy to be here because it's Friday, and I agree. Now, Let's see, Christina, Miss Tally, how are you? What up, Cody, what up? Eddie, Omar, Grant, the Lego guy, Victor, hello, yes. all the knights, shout out. Shout out to keto. the knights. Alondra, Matt, Sunny, Rich, hello, welcome everybody. Sanchez, Munger Tech, Big Family 06. La Familia Who Mesa is, in the chat. Who's ready to draw, fam? Let us know. Give me one sec, out of balance. There we go. Amalos, amalos. DCA, Hello, DCA. Scott. DCA time. Yes. They're about to play the jams already. Oh, the jams be hitting. The jams be hitting out here. Right? Sounds good, I'm in. <laughs> I'm totally down for I'm it. I'm so down too. It's a blessing that we're growing. Like, La Familia be growing. And we're in for it. We're right. in for it. They're asking, what's the 21K ambassador? Uh, Whoever we draw right now, no? I was going to give it up to Blue for the vlog earlier today that we did. But if you want to go ahead and do Almost it for the uh, drawing right now, we can do it. We can do it. Is there lag in the in the chat, fam? It's a little bit, but you know how the YouTube thing is going. Yeah, no. So YouTube what up, fam? Garden's calling it tonight. It says, we're going to hit 22 tonight. Maybe. Maybe. We'll see. We'll see. Hello, Queen J. Ray. How right, are you? We're, so we're going to draw like in about 15 minutes. 7.30 is like the goal. Hello. Is what we're going to try to draw, fam. Appreciate it. Thank you so much. Hey there. How are you? We Thank you. This. Have a great night. I believe so. Let's go. What up, Queen J. Ray? Hello, fam. Saludos a todos. Okay. Saluditos. We have, let's do seven minutes of merch. Seven minutes, that's going to be the quickest Seven merch. minutes of merch. Wow. Let, let's not, let's not okay. like, because we will do more <laughs> merch later tonight. Vamos a buscar más uh, mercancías esta noche. Yeah, throughout the whole entire stream, we're we, going to be doing the merch. There's we're going to so try to draw at 7.30 is okay. the goal. Okay. So we need to get 7 over there. 7.30 like, is the latest now. we can do drawing today. Because there are stuff going on and we'll talk about it. Have we seen the scented Lotto plush? No. Oh, wait, we wait. We saw the it at the outlets. At the outlets, it was there. At the, the Ontario Mills yeah. outlets. I'm tempted to look at no, pins. No, we have oh. no time to look at pins right no, now. No, no time for pins. No time for no pins. No time okay. whatsoever. Focus. My focus needs more focus. Your focus Let's needs see. more focus. Now, there are some new Munchlings that have dropped. There are new ears that have dropped. We have the Tommy Hilfiger collection that dropped. The I whole mean, entire collection while we were gone. How dare they? While we were over at Universal. We were at Universal. Time. Come on. Let us know, guys. Who saw our newest foodie vlog? Let us know. One for yes, two for I need to watch it, and three for um, I did not get the notification. Right. The Emmy Sir jersey. Mm -hmm, Don't mm -hmm, even mm -hmm. start talking about this one, baby, because you know I'm going to want it. I already want it, but it's a nice one. It's a lovely one. That bonito. Yeah, $79.99 on I mean, that. That's center price for like the four what it is for the spare jerseys. But with that said, ear wall update. Ear wall update. I see a lot of ones in the chat. A lot of, I already hit the like button, already liked it. Those Joey, uh, from the Joey collab, those are very beautiful. I still love yeah. the one with Tinkerbell. That more All right, let's spin around. Spin around? Three times. <laughs> what a mouse Wait, like and beers. How are you? La Reina needs that. La Reina needs everything. She is like on a, on a wish list for everything. And I still gotta go take her shopping because um, coming this next week, we have something amazing that we will talk about once it happens. But we have something, a blessing that's happening. Hold on, let's go see those peluches real quick. Wait, this, there, it, there's no signal in this area. We're, we're checking, we're checking, we're checking. Yes, okay, so I'm popping in here real quick because this is the update in regards to who's here in the parks. We have both Sully and Marie Sully Antoinette. Sully is so cute. And yes. of course, Minnie Mouse. These are the weighted plushies with the uh, two and a half point weight in, be in them. Designed for those that are uh, to be... Comforting. Come on, comforting. Oh, it's a comforting twin, you're right. Oh, yes. and Simba, and Simba Tamiya. It's a weighted plushie. Yeah, I do love, love me life. these ones. These are so cute and comfy. Está bonito. $39.99. $39.99. Yes. Pero el mejor. Hey. Hi, I'm a fan of you. Oh, thank you, buddy. How are you today? 
good. Good? That's Are you having awesome. a great time with your family at Disneyland? Yeah. Yeah? What well, rides have you been on? Uh, None today? Uh, uh, so many. Oh, Matter really? Wow. We did a rope drop. Oh, cool. You guys did rope drop? Uh, they uh, they had that oh my gosh. I'm sorry that happened. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> the there's the lab and everything. Like, just all tired. And like, why? <laughs> did you guys manage to get to something else after that, though? Uh, we did many. Yes, right. we went to Toy, uh, was it Toy, Toy, Story, Toy Story Mania. Oh, okay. that one's okay. fun. Yes. Nice. Oh, that's a great one. Okay, good, good. Yeah. You guys closing out the park tonight? We are. We are. They're not. <laughs> oh, that's not that's true. So get, get a true in it. Hang in there, guys. Hang in there. They're tired already. Oh, oh I bet. It's a lot. It's okay. Yeah, it's no, okay. We get you. you want to say hi to the stream since we're on right now? Yeah? yeah. All right, buddy. Check it out. Check it out, guys. The we got the fam right here. And real life, they rope drop. Oh, my gosh. But they're going to knock out okay. soon. Well, we hope that you guys have an amazing time. Have Thank fun. you for saying Thanks hi. For saying hope hi, you guys have a great one today. Bye. 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 All right. So, los peluches. Totally lovely in regards to this. Okay, so continuing on, because we do only have seven minutes before we gotta go do the drawing, and I think I may have lost a minute or two, which is always worth worth uh, uh, spending a good minute con la familia. Always a pleasure getting to say hi to you guys in el parque. Platicar con ustedes, saludarlos. All right, quick Numo update. The new update. Mulan is coming out next week. Which I'm so surprised. <laughs> We've been waiting for her forever. I'm wondering why they're holding back until next week, you know? What up, B Mills? What up, Cody? What up, Margie? And hi to the girls. And you talk of Magic Happens Parade merch? Uh, Richard, not that I know of. But we'll that would be amazing. That would be amazing. We'll get to it when we when we get a chance. We got to talk about something else in a bit. But, I mean, there's a lot of information. There's a lot of cheese I mean, we, we got the Oogie Boogie cheese man. We got the Color of One cheese man. We got, right. como se llama, La Ropita cheese man. We got Movie cheese man. I mean, the, the list goes on and on. On oh, and on Chris. and on. I know. <laughs> All right, I think we're going to have to call it and go. Go draw? Or not okay. yet. No, no. Well, it's 16 right now. 16? Yeah, we should go. Now, tonight is grad night, so that is why there's a little bit of urgency in our voice right now to make sure we can draw before it gets at? too packed up um, in it. Because with it being grand night, the park will be closing on DCA side. Wait, hold on, baby. We'll really? Pass you're leaving me behind. No, You're never. just like walking, walking, walking. Oh, I am like, walking. Wait a minute. I'm never. I would never leave you behind. Okay. <gasps> okay. Let me just so, see it here. I, I can. I can spend two minutes. Pardon me. All right. So let's do the Tommy Hilfiger collection found at Elias and Company. Ooh. La Playera. Okay. This one hey. collection is so cute. I love it. I wish there was something just with Goofy like that. That is fire. I mean, the fact that you get him right there. What a Ah, tan bonito. Now that's an extra extra small, which rarely comes in the parks. I see for las playeras, but it goes from extra extra small to two X. Ninety nine ninety. Ninety nine ninety nine. It's a okay, really baby. thick tee, though. It's a nice quality. That's, that's so awesome, nice. and it does have the Disney one hundred right on the here. Edge. Yeah. That's cute. Okay. Vuelta, 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 suerte. The Mickey sweater. This is so adorable. The Winky Mickey. Está this bien. is a thick sweater, fam. Like, it is heavy. <laughs> it's going to keep you warm. What do you no, guys think? One for cute. yes, two for no. It's, it's, it's a shame that it came out now wow. because, you know, it, it's not cold enough to rock it. Yeah, yeah. But you just save it for that really special night, though. For real. What up, no? 269 for oh. it. That's beautiful. That's okay. really nice. Well, this one is a size large. Just in case you guys want to like do the size reference. I mean, it is. It it doesn't. It looks like it's all oversized. It but is comfy vibes. Yeah. You know. Well, that looks some leggings. That's what it looks like on the mannequin right some there. Just dark, for. Yeah. Actually, that looks really nice. Does with the hat. Okay, let's talk about this shirt right here. The white one with the. I like Mickey's eyes on this. I wish this was a Funko Pop. Or oh, if I could get it on a hat like that, that's cute. This is adorable, like, right? I don't Mickey, right? Uh, Hello, Tiffy. I agree. What a man! It Let's is see, rather heavy 89 on that one. 89.90. 89.90? Well, eh? <laughs> You're like, what? <laughs> For a white shirt? Oh my. <laughs> but it's I, the brand. You're, true, true. I mean, it's the collab. You're buying the Tommy Hill figure. I, that would only make it to like, maybe Bam. round one of barbecue. I like the hat. What do you think about the hat? The hat is cute. Is that 39? Because it's a collab hat? It should be more than 39. You think it's more than 39? Yeah. I did. Let me see, yeah, 69.90. I'm like, 39. That better keep the sun out and put like, you know, glasses that drop off and down. That's a lot. 
Those are cute. Ooh, the Tommy Hilfiger ears. Oh my gosh. They're super lightweight. Now you can tell Tabuli. that these are comfortable. They're meant to be comfortable. For me? Yeah, these are really cute. Yeah, these, yeah so I'll be waiting for them later. I What's mean, the biggest I'll size? Be waiting, size? I'll be waiting for these ones later too. $69.50 for the ears. So big fam, I got big sizes on right for going to 2X on those sweaters and those shirts right now. Mm-hmm. This is cute. That is a cute jumper. Yeah. Is it a jumper? No, or it's, it's a dress. It just like has that really nice That snatch print is waist. super cute. That's why it kind of looks like a two piece, but it's it's a what one a single Corey. piece. But there's like a separation. That way it feels like it's a top and a bottom. No, yeah. I just like that it has pockets. 229 Pocket with the little cute oh, Mickey's. Nice. Yeah, all the Tommy Hilfiger stuff I'm is gonna expensive. I'm going to wait for it to be at the outlet. <laughs> This is a cute skirt. What do you guys think about the that skirt? That is a cute skirt though. Yeah. Like if, if you got the funds for it to go ahead and do it, get it. I mean, right. treat yourself right. 199 on it. But si llega la oportunidad to be at the outlets the or like- The shorts. Or if Shop, or Shop Disney has a sale, definitely jump on it. They're not gonna have this on sale. This is brand spanking new, dude. No, yeah. 199 for the shorts. Maybe it's because I'm used to seeing Tommy Phil figure prices like at the Ross or like Marshall's. So like, yeah, I don't see the full price. Yeah, that's completely way different. 229 for this one. Está bonito. I like the sweater though. Oh my the gosh. Anime style, the anime style for Mickey was dope. Really. Dude, I really want the sweater. It's a really nice material. 229 yeah. on it. Thank you, Cody. We're going to race around and don't worry, buddy. We'll Min come back. Minnie and Donald are on the list to, to be seen <laughs> today. Okay. But there are some things we got to prioritize tonight. All right, guys. We will continue checking the merch in a moment. Give us a minute. Right, Hoping for mini around the corner, but no. All right. Let's go. Let's go. What up, Felipe? Daniela. Right, mouse and beers like it, but it, it. You know what it is? It's because like '90s clothes is still trending. Like '90s grunge is now like the the thing to also be rocking. So. Tommy Hilfiger is kind of in that like like style, the preppy the the preppy pieces. Yeah, it's a lot of like the preppy look, but it's cute though. I like it, but it's not my ordinary like go to style. But a piece or two, I mean, it looks nice. No, yeah, like but what lo que está bonito de esa marca de esa ropa por más que está cara porque es es una colaboración con Tommy Hilfiger es que es buena calidad. Like it really is good it's quality. It's a completely like, different you can, quality. You can feel it in the texture. You can see it. Like I assure you, as good as it's it looks stuff through it. It's stuff above the regular theme park. Yeah, merch, so you're which paying. Which like, yeah, we get nice um, items, but that quality is actually like quality. It, it's quality. a piece that you're going to have for a while. Like yes. that's, that's where it gets exactly. to right Exactly. So vamos. What up, Julie? We're going to go draw. Let's go. Are we watching World of Color? Yes. yes, Cody. Yes, yes, yes. So tonight, there's only one World of Color showing because again, it is Karad night. So only one is open to the public at nine o'clock. And yeah. with that said, there's we... going to be a new elemental short in the beginning of the show. Yeah. So we are so excited to see what they made the for that world movie. The premiere is today for it. The world premiere oh of that my short. Gosh, so. why should have been at the movies. No, 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 for the short that we're going to see right oh, now. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Calmada, calmada. Oh, oh, so that one's a limited time that yes. it'll be here. Whoa, do we fit? Yeah. Uh, we might fit, we might fit. We should be, we should. Let me go check who we're drawing, or should it be a surprise? You can check. Check? Yeah. All right, we'll see if we get in there. There might be space. Ooh, okay, we're at the... Ooh, this is Jamie James. Yeah. That's Hi there, too. Thank you so much. Over there. All right. The Spider Verse. We saw Spider Verse already. We gotta watch it again, though. We have a. Uh, we have. We have. We have our own thoughts on that film. So it's going to be... Disney or Disney Pixar? Did you already hear what it is? Disney. No. It's Disney? Yeah. Okay. Male or female? Male. Male? Disney male. Is it human or animal? Animal. 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 Is it Sebastian? It's a master class. It's a master... Human? Oh, we're drawing Buzz Lightyear. No. 
I said not human, animal. Oh. Huh. Is Pooh and Tigger? No, I don't think those are master classes, guys. It's a master class animal Disney. Animal Disney. See? It all checks out. And then we're gonna fill the ramps. Oh, sure. okay. Is it Scrooge? No, I wish. Flounder. What up, Kevin? Has hello, Nova. It's <laughs> not Mickey. It's not Mad Hatter. Either. Nova says we're drawing me. It's not Eli, oh. unfortunately. Is it Pooh? Goofy? No. No. It's not Pooh. It's not Goofy. You can't look over there, Eli. I see him trying to pee. Did you see it? Is it Bambi? I wish it was Bambi. How you guys are not. So it's a male animal. Yeah. Disney character. Yeah. Dumbo. No. Hey, Sarbury. It is not Dumbo. Is it Cheshire Cat? I feel like you're not even thinking close to it. It's not Cheshire Cat. You're are we drawing Scar? No, we are not drawing Scar. Is it a main character? It's almost a main character. Almost a main character? Almost. Okay, so it's not Stitch. It's more, it is Stitch. It is Stitch? Stitch yeah. is a main character. It's Lilo and Stitch, yeah, I guess. I, w I would consider him a sidekick almost, but yeah. Dang, Kevin called it. Show! Stitch. Go, Kevin. I didn't know that that was a <laughs> master class. So. We've never been in the same room twice. <laughs> Wait, huh? I didn't know it was a master Stitch? class. Stitch, yeah, because of the teeth? I think it's the teeth the and the tea? eyes. I think we've drawn him like once or twice. We have drawn him. Yeah. Hello, buddy. But we'll see. We'll we see. Haven't, I mean, Buzz Lightyear hasn't been on the program in a while. That's true. I That's miss true. drawing Buzz Lightyear. And they actually did have an 8 and an 8.30 class today. Right, but because it's World of Color for the premiere of that little short in front of it. Okay, so today, for today, they had characters like Mickey, they had Artist Choice, Piglet, Baymax, which I want to draw Baymax. Which? Grogu, Sisu, Raya, and oh. then a whole bunch of the Disney 100 exclusives. Ooh, that's awesome. They drew Tiana, which we have Tiana, Cheeseman, and a bit to go over. Well, we have the Tiana, Cheeseman. We have uh, updates over at um, San Francisco, More which updates. I got to see. For over an hour, master classes are about 45 minutes. So yeah, we'd be here for a quick minute. But you said there's one at what time? 8, 8.30. 8 and 8.30? Yeah. That uh, seems kind of odd for a master class to be so short. Let me see. Hold on. Yeah. Is that not a master class? That... Yeah, that's master yeah. class. Yeah. That's it. 8, 30, 8 p.m. is Sully and 8.30 is Mike. Huh. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, that's why I'm like, why is it considered a master class? It seems like a regular The drawing. ears? No. The eyes? Maybe. The face. It has to be with the face. Yeah. We, mm, could be. Could be. Yeah, how many the dreams made it to draw? Well, we'll see if we can get in, fam. We're right outside the gates. <laughs> drawing Piglet would be very cool. Red is also oh awesome to draw. Oh my gosh, Evelyn, con congratulations for graduating from nursing school. Yeah, let's go. Evelyn, 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 ra, ra, ra. Hearts in the chat for our newest nurse, Evelyn. That's amazing, Evelyn. That's a blessing. Much, much blessings on your new journey. Yeah. Like, that is so incredible here. Thank you for all the, like, the nights that you sacrificed, you know, for studying, the flashcards. That's oh my amazing. gosh, so many flashcards. Yes. Nurses keep the world going round. Appreciate That's you. That's true. Yeah, the Arctic Rescue over at SeaWorld. Actually, a lot of things have been happening over at SeaWorld San Diego as well. They got that new kids play area that uh -huh. just recently opened up. And then they also came out with a new poster. It's like one of the longest. So I'm like, what? I want to go check it out for sure. San Diego trip day? San Diego. Yeah. Maybe we can start off at Sesame Place and end in SeaWorld. Yeah. Or we can do a vlog and then a live at SeaWorld. Okay. I just want to see the parade at Sesame Street. I want to see the parade. Yeah. The parade is pretty chill out yeah. there. We haven't been to Sesame Place since it first opened up. No, we, but missed, that day, we missed the one year anniversary. 
That's on me. I had to work. I had to work. That's okay. Yeah. Like, you doesn't come out on? No, yeah. Like, San Diego County, like, County Period has, like, some great seafood spots. They have really amazing food, period. And Queen J Ray gifted One Bee Plus E membership. Who did it go to? It went to Andrew. Andrew Congrats Andrew. on that. Yeah. Jen, 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 we either draw or we snack. It's one of the two. San Diego, ra ra ra. Okay, it seems like you guys still want us to go out to San Diego. I mean, it could be cool. We could do, we could stream the sesame one. And then just like chill, do the walkthrough. And then we can go to San Diego and stream the rest of the day. Like, might as well make the San Diego trip worth it. All right, my friends, welcome in. Thank you. Yeah, I got it, sorry. <laughs> Sir Doverfield's in the house. Doverfield, how are you? What up, fam? Ya vamos a entrar. Ya vamos a dibujar, familia. ¿Quién está listo, eh? Ya estamos listos para dibujar. Oh, dude, you don't have to look at ID. You can just do it on uh, Discord as well. Absolutely free. Vamos, vamos. I wish it was another long weekend. Oh, great, Chris. I know. That would be That'd spectacular. Be nice. Cody's going to SeaWorld next Sunday. Woo woo. Enjoy, my friend. Don't forget the sunscreen. We should go to Hawaii. Oh, why didn't you say yeah, this? Though? I that's definitely a want to go That's a blessing, my enjoy, friend. What happened? I went to a nowhere place. with Vinyl Traveler. Woo woo, fam. Hello, How fam. How are y'all doing today? Is that Sam? How are you, too? We're excited. Excited for next week. Do you want to do a yellow? Oh, bottom row. Bottom row? Okay. Which side do you want? I'll take this one right here. Paper, our draw class, very quickly becomes a city class. All right, guys, we'll talk after. after. But with that, it does look like our doors are closed, which means our class is officially in session. So I want to welcome everybody to the Animation Academy. My name is Sam. I'm a Disney artist here to teach you how to draw one of my favorite characters. He is a little blue alien from outer space. Does anybody know what I'm talking about? Hey, Mondo. Experience 626 himself is Stitch. Just a couple things to go over before we begin our class. On the way in, you met my friend Thomas. Everybody say, hello, Thomas. Hello, Thomas. Good, very proper. I like that. You guys follow two very well. Well, Thomas is another amazing Disney artist here. He is also going to be the TA for this class. So if your pencil breaks or rolls underneath the seat in front of you, just raise your hand so one of us can see you. We can help you out with whatever you need. If you didn't exit the show early, you're going to head right back up those stairs. You came down, get a big push on that third door. That's going to take you right out to the courtyard, just as Thomas is demonstrating. Maybe you got a bathroom emergency, G plus emergency, churro emergency. They are real, I know. All you got to do is head back up those stairs. Now, on to the fun stuff. Is anybody here for their first time ever tonight at the animation? Can you raise your hands up nice and high? Okay, a few people. Amazing. Welcome to all of our new artists out there. Welcome back to our returning alumni as well. Always wonderful to see all of you again. But for everybody out there in the audience, you're going to notice we're missing something on the ends of our pencils. What are we missing? An eraser. An eraser. Yeah, we don't have any erasers on the ends of our pencils, but this is a new thing we're trying here. If you look right underneath the bottom of your seat there, right underneath, right in the middle of those benches, if you look down there, you'll find absolutely nothing down there. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my gosh, that's so hilarious. But we don't have any racers anywhere in this classroom, but if you're here, you're going to have a great time. Let's go ahead and get started. Let's go ahead and get started. 
it is okay. I promise. Together we'll make it through. This is a rough sketch class, so all that means is we're going to start our lines really light and sketchy. So just start everything really light. I promise I'll let you know when we're going to go back and make things a little bit darker. Now with that, are we ready to draw a stitch? Yeah. yeah. Let's do it. All right. Stitch is going to start right about the center of our page, a little bit lower down than the halfway mark, with a horizontal guideline. Now again, just like I was talking about before, we're going to start by keeping all of our lines really nice and light and sketchy, just like the name or rough sketching implies. I'm starting really lightly, but just a nice horizontal line there, right? A little bit below the center of my page. And from here, I like to turn this into kind of like a staple shape. I'm going to add in two of these little um, like vertical lines right here on either side of my horizontal guideline. And then I'm going to turn this into like a big sunset or maybe like half of a heart taco shell. I'm going to connect those two vertical lines together with a nice big tall rainbow. Now as you can see, I'm going over this quite a few times, kind of changing up the shape as I'm adding it in. That's the best part about rough sketching, is that as long as we're starting really light, we can just ignore the lines that we don't like and darken in the ones that we do. That's really how I go about all my life, probably students ignoring the things I don't like. <laughs> I don't know, it's just work for me. Now that we have our big sunset in place on our page, I'm going to come back in here and change this shape into a bit more of like a gumdrop shape. Obviously, Stitch does not have a perfectly flat bottom of his face. So I'm going to come back down here and add in a really nice soft letter U shape to turn his face into more of a gumdrop shape. You'll have to bear with me. I like to use a lot of food references when I'm trying to describe my shapes and stuff. But I don't know what you expect because at the end of the day, I am a starving artist. Say, I get it. Say, there's a lot of comments where everybody's like, yes, yeah, say, relatable. I love that. We got a whole bunch of artists out there. Wonderful. Well, now that we have the basic shape in place for Stitch, it looks absolutely nothing like him. So we have to go back in here and add in some more shapes and lines to make this look a little bit more like the character we know and love. I'm going to start by adding in one more of these guidelines right down the center of my page, or right down the center of my shape, I should say. That's going to help me keep things nice and centered here. And with that, I also like to add in a bit more of the silhouette, the basic silhouette for Stitch, just so I can see this character a little bit more. So I'm going to add in his ears. I'm going to go ahead and add in two of these diagonal lines pulling up towards the top corners of my page. And then I'm going to add in two big letter C shapes on either side. I'm just going to even this out first. I like to add in a lot of lines, guidelines, and stuff just to help me make things nice and even here. Make sure his ears are like the same height there. And then I'll go back in. We're still keeping everything really light again. I haven't darkened in anything yet. But like I said, I like to add in the ears at this point because it gives me a little bit more of the silhouette of Stitch. And if I were to shade in all of these shapes, you'd look at it and be like, who's that Pokemon? It's Stitch! <laughs> yeah, exactly, right? Alright, now that we have our Stitch silhouette in place, we can come back in and start adding in the actual features for this little guy. I'm going to start with his nose here, right on top of my horizontal guideline, right in the center here. I'm going to really lightly sketch him in a little circle there, right on top of that horizontal guideline. And now you have off brand of him. <laughs> but we got to go ahead and make it look a little bit more like Stitch here. So I'm going to go ahead and as I'm walking in this shape, I'm turning it more into a triangle. So I'm flattening off the top of my circle here. And I'll bring it down to a bit more of a joint as I'm locking it in. This is the first feature on my drawing that I'm going to go ahead and lock in. But maybe if you've never drawn with us here before, and you've never heard that term locking it in, that is totally fine. All it really means is that I'm coming back in here, picking my favorite line, and making it a little darker so that it stands out above all the sketchy lines that I started with. With that being said, this is actually the only place in the entire Disneyland Resort where you're encouraged to be just a little bit sketchy. <laughs> yeah, crazy. Alright, now that I have his nose in place here, I'm going to go ahead and add in some nostrils on either side of this nose here. I'm adding in some nice soft little curves. 
I'm going to shave those in. One of the things that Stitch is really good at is uh, picking a winner, if you know what I mean. So we got to give him those nostrils. And you can shave those in if you want to as well for a little bit of extra credit. I also want to add in Stitch's smile right below his nose here. Stitch is actually very loosely based off of koalas as well as a very specific breed of dogs. Anybody have any guesses what breed of dogs Stitch might be based on? A Frenchie. Not a Chihuahua. A Frenchie. A French Bulldog. Yes, exactly. Very good. He kind of has that like squished in nose the way that French Bulldogs do. And it's funny because before I even knew that, I always said that French Bulldogs like reminded me of Stitch. When I, I never realized it was literally the other way around, but I guess it was my brain just like <laughs> subconsciously telling me. I don't know. But I'm going to add in this horizontal line right below his nose there. And to make sure he's giving us a little bit more of like a smile expression, he's giving us like a nice thin mischievous smile. I'm turning up the corners of this line here, either end of this line, I'm turning those up towards the top of my page, and I can cap those off with some little rainbows as well to show that the cheeks are being pushed up a little bit by this adorable little smile. To finish off the bottom of his face here, I'm going to add in one more letter U shape. Just to give him a little bit of a lower lip there. Now for Stitch's eyes, he actually has something that is called a character mask that helps frame out his eyes. It's just those two big patches around his eyes that are kind of more of that light blue color. This is actually something that comes from the very early eras of animation. Even characters like Mickey and Minnie have a character mask. It's that big black letter M shape that frames out their eyes. It just really helps us bring our attention and our eyes to these characters' eyes. Since that is where we get a lot of the emotion from, especially in animated characters. So I just went down here, connected Stitch's nose out to the side of his face with those nice soft letter U shapes. And for the top of his character mask, I like to add in a big like rainbow or candy cane shape stretching from the corners of his nose up towards the top of his face and then out to the sides. So I'm going to start really lightly just searching for that shape and then once I have something I like, I can go ahead and lock in this character mask. Now with this character, I always have to talk a little bit about the setting of this film. Does anybody know where this movie takes place? Hawaii. Hawaii, exactly. Now you may not have known it, but that was not always in the plan for this film. When they were first working on the concept of this movie, they just knew they wanted Stitch to be stranded somewhere in the middle of nowhere, very isolated, and one of the locations that they actually came up with was going to be Kansas. For whatever reason, they were like, maybe if we stranded Stitch in a cornfield, maybe that would do it. I don't know. But we used to always joke here at Animation Academy that part of the reason that they chose Hawaii over Kansas is because they knew they were going to have to do a research trip to the location that this movie took place in. And like, yeah, I'd, I'd probably want to go to Kauai over Kansas too. No offense to anybody from Kansas, but <laughs> hey, that's a good thing. But in a recent interview for the 20th anniversary of the movie Lilo and Stitch, the creator and co-director of Lilo and Stitch actually kind of confirmed that among other reasons. That was one of the reasons they kind of leaned a little bit more towards Hawaii rather than setting the show in Kansas. Now I'm going to come back in here once I have these character masks all locked in place and I will also go ahead and thicken up a little bit of this top portion. I'm going to make the top of this character mask a little bit thicker because this is going to give him a little bit more of an eyebrow. He doesn't necessarily have super defined eyebrows. But he kind of uses the top of this character mask to help him be a little bit more expressive. So go ahead and darken it in a little thicker up there. And the shape of Stitch's eyes is very similar to the character mask that we just added in place there. So I'll come back along the bottom, right next to his nose, and stretch out that letter U shape. And you could totally stop right here and say that Stitch is like taking a little nap, maybe. He hasn't had his little baby bottle of coffee yet. So we gotta wake up. But we're gonna go ahead and stretch out some nice big rainbow shapes again, right on top of our letter U's. Give him those nice big alien eyes. So I did mention the name Chris Sanders, and we have a lot to thank Chris Sanders for in this film. 
Like I said, not only was he a co-director on this film, but he was actually the one who originally came up with the idea for a lot of these characters and the original story for Lilo and Stitch, as well as he did provide the voice for Stitch himself. And one of the things I have to mention as well, too, is that Chris Sanders is on TikTok. So if you have a TikTok account, go out there and look for Chris Sanders' TikTok. Uh, he does talk a lot about the behind the scenes of kind of, you know, working on the film and what that was like. And he also just posts a lot of funny videos of, like, going to a drive through and ordering food in the Stitch voice. So you really get a lot of variety there. Now once I have these eyes all locked in place for Stitch, he is kind of starting to look like he has seen some things. Oh, or maybe that's what he looked like when he first, you know, like dropped out of space, his eyes were like glowing green. A little bit. But we're going to make him look a little bit cuter by adding in a bit of a highlight right here towards the inside of his eyes. Since his pupils are so big, they do catch a little bit of that light, so we're going to add a little sparkle to his eyes. And we can even shade in everything around that little sparkle as well. You want to go ahead and shade those eyes in really nice and dark. These people should be the darkest parts of your drawing. Because like I mentioned earlier, we really want our focus to be drawn to these eyes since that's where we get all of the emotion and expression from in our animated characters. With these eyes all shaded in place, to finish off the top of Stitch's face, we're going to add in some little ridges for like those eyebrow muscles. Again, he doesn't have actual eyebrows, but he does have these little eyebrow muscles. They're just little rainbows right above his character wraps. And Stitch always says he is cute and cuddly. I heard a lot of different answers out there. Cuddly, fuzzy. Okay, to be clear, he says he is cute and fluffy. There we go. That's the one. So we're going to go ahead and add in a little bit of fluff to the top of his head. I like to add in a few of these little shark fin shapes right up at the top of his head. The more you add in here, the more he's going to look like he just rolled out of bed. I'm going to add in maybe like three of them, kind of pointing in all different directions here. And then I'll just pick my favorite line from the top of my like, original gumdrop shape and lock that in finish off the top of his face and I'll also go back down in here and lock in the bottom of his face as well since that's starting to fade into the background of my drawing. Go back in here and lock that in. And one of my favorite little cameos I guess you could say in this film is that there is actually a little reference to another Disney film in this movie. And that scene where Leela goes into Nami's bedroom and She's like showing Stitch how he can do the thing where he puts his finger on the record and like opens his mouth and turns into a record player. She goes into Nani's bedroom and Nani actually has a poster on her bedroom wall from Mulan. Uh, now this was not just any random film that they decided to sneak in there. This is actually kind of a reference to film, if you would, for Lilo and Stitch because Mulan was one of only three other films that was created at the Florida Animation Studios. If you didn't know, for a while, uh, Disney actually had a Florida branch of the Disney Animation Studios that actually uh, functioned out of Hollywood Studios. They had a real working animation studio in Hollywood Studios that produced Lilo and Stitch, Mulan, as well as Brother Bear. It was super cool. They kind of got to hit a little nod to their other films in that movie as well. Now I'm just going back over here on the top of my diagonal lines for Stitch's ears and adding in some little letter S curves. Before I lock in the outside of his ears, I also like to add in some little V cutouts because Stitch has definitely been through his fair share of battles out here for sure, out in space. You know, he's probably been through a lot before he makes his way to Lilo. But then I'll go ahead and lock in the rest of that letter C curve back down to his face, doing the same thing on the other side. Another final detail that I like to add in the image of ears is just to show a little bit of the outer versus the inner fold of his ears here. I'm going to go back over in the back and connect the back of his ears just here to the sides of his face. Me too. 
So with that, anything else that you want to add into your drawing is going to be extra credit. So maybe you want to add Jumba or Weekly in there. But the very last mark that any artist absolutely needs on their drawing is going to be your signature. With that, you have created your very own portrait of the most adorable little alien in all of outer space. It is a Stitch. With that, how did we do, everyone? Oh, my gosh. Okay, I lost like 50% of you, but the other 50% is good. I love that. All right. Well, I went a little bit over time, so I'm going to run out of here. But go ahead and give yourselves a huge round of applause. Yay, bye. I'm sure these all of them out of this universe. You can go ahead and take those drawings off your board. Those are for you to keep and take home with you. Thank you so much for joining us here tonight, everybody. I hope you had so much fun and class is Bye. How about a great big round of applause for your awesome artists? Am everybody. Thank you all for joining us here at the Animation Academy. The doors on your left, the same three doors that you entered through, are now open for you to exit through as well. Please exit That's only it. through those same three doors yeah. when you stand up. Please put the drawing boards back up against the back of the seat. Please put the pencils. All right, back let's go. As well. Okay, how did everybody do? I can't wait to see you guys' drawings. So, estamos esperando con anticipación para ver sus dibujos. So, compártelos con nosotros a través de Instagram o el Discord también. <laughs> And don't forget to share your uh, finished drawings on Discord or Instagram. Tag us. Tag us. And then, of course, if I can hit the next to go ahead and give a cast member compliment for Sam and Thomas. Uh, Thomas being the, the assistant of the class for today. And Sam doing an amazing job. Amazing. She sped through that. like, But you didn't feel like you, at least I didn't feel like I was lost in regards to no. the steps. She did a really she did good a remarkable job. job. Honestly, she did. All right, let, let us vote. Vamos a votar. It's chilly out here, huh, baby? Te voy a abrazar bien pegadito during the world of color. Okay. All right. Here's option number one. Ooh. Hi. This is num number uno. Okay. And here is number two. <laughs> My name is Stitch. Ooh. Okay, let us know, guys. This Ooh. is number one. This is number two. Our 21K ambassador is... Stitch. <laughs> This is my time. I drew it on my own. <laughs> Let me see, guys. Ooh. Look at the eyes right here. Big anime googly eyes. It's a googly bear. That's cute. This is cuter. What up, Gisela? What is it looking like? They're both adorable, right, Bouncers and Beers? I think the two wins. Felipe goes Number, with one? No, they're both used with pencil. With pencil. Que bonitos ojos, dices Dave. Ah, Dave recomendándose con el Spanish. One and two, one, two, two, pachuco, says two. Dang. They'd be funny looking, yo. Who <laughs> uh, took it? Hump. Number, <laughs> really? number one took it or is it a tie? It's a tie. I'm going to give it to number two. I'm going to give it to a tie. You want to give it a tie? This one's Eli's. It's not even Father's Day and you're giving tile ties. This one's Eli's. <laughs> This That's one, good. This one's mine yeah, right there. there. I like it. All right, let's roll out. Vámonos. Let's step outside for the moment. There we go. Oh. All right. Let's go park it. All right, we're going to share your drawings in a moment. Then we got some merch to check. Then we got to get over to World of Color. And then we're going to cross over to Design for Fireworks and all that fun. All that fun. A ver, la los chancita. Should we continue charging this? Because this is like hot. Yeah, that stays hot. Yeah? Yeah. Should we... I think it's enough, no? No. Why? Because you need it for World of Color. A ver, Here, a ver. grab this. Yes, I will put those away. I want you work on that. Welcome in everybody. Cannot wait to pull up the Discord drawings, all the Instagram drawings. The Twitter fam, I know one day the Twitter fam will come through. They'll come through. They'll come through. Yes. See, see, see. It's just the people on Twitter are shy. No, <laughs> they're not. Sorry, I'm not going to eat you. 
Hey, there's time, Cody. No worries, dude. I thought we are going to cross over to Disneyland and catch her over there. We okay. don't see her here. Mad drew a whole bunch Dang. of Avengers drawings. Those look so cool. That Spider-Man's on point, dude. Yeah, Jeez. that's fire. These, those that's would nice. be so dope. I'd buy that as stickers. Here's Blue 22. Yeah, blue. It's cute. Dang, that came out the really shady. good. I like that yeah. extra little dip on the lip. That's, that's amazing. That's that, That's really Schultz. well done. See, Schultz. Oh, that's amazing. My good job. so cute. Good job, Callie fam. Grown. Callie Grown. Dude, wow. that's legit from the movie. I like, like it. I like the extra, like, drawing, like, that extra outlines When he did. finds a little book, that's what he looks like. Here's Cutie Alondra. Ay, Alondra te salió bonito. It's really pretty. Or handsome. Christina. Whatever you call <laughs> Christina. It looks Ooh. like he's admiring Pug the Fish. Está <laughs> <laughs> bonito. So cute. This one's Julie's. Julie and Alex. Oh, wow. Oh, they're both great. That's, that's a hard, that, that, that's a tie. That's a tie right there in that house. Okay. Let me see if anyone tagged us on the Grammy Gram. No worries. We'll check them out in a moment. Stitch can be pretty. Yes. All the drawings are so good, right, Sky? I agree. Okay, yeah, no, no tags so far. Nothing on oh, Instagram? actually, Scampwood. Scamp, Scamp Wood. Norwood. Thanks oh, to all Jamie. Job. Super happy Stitch Camp. <laughs> Great I job. Love it. Great job, Jaime. Ah, ver, a ver. Oh, Didi, hope you feel better soon. Okay, uh -huh. and that's it for now. A ver, everyone did great. Okay, 756. Let's go do the rest of the merch. Let's go in. And then. I feel like we're on a time crunch. We today. are on a time crunch. We're on a, the only reason we're on a time crunch is because. Uh, today is, again, a reminder for those joining in right now, it is grad night, so that means grad there's only night. one world of color tonight. Sad and you're like, face. And you're like, well, wait a minute, like, B plus C, when was the last time we did world of color? We're doing world ages. of color. We're it's doing been ages. <laughs> We're doing world of color tonight because it is the world premiere of the new elemental short in front of it. I'll so we of got, it, yes. yeah, so we got to, we got to show you all that's this amazing. amazing. Well, who's yeah. excited for the movie? I know I am. I'm ready for that movie. I'm ready for the merch. I'm, I'm excited for, for those ears. Those I ears look those pretty ears. cool. Eh? Yeah. I, they should have dropped them today with that short. Would have been nice. It so, would have been brilliant. So let me let me translate that in Spanish real quick to the fan okay. band that's watching. So, para los que están aquí con nosotros el día de hoy mirando, estamos ahorita un poquito apresurados al respeto del tiempo porque el parque de Disneylandia California Aventura, donde lo encontramos ahorita, cierra las 9 de la noche esta noche porque tienen el evento de los que se han graduado de la secundaria. Con eso en mente, también hoy es la primera noche que van a tener un cambio al show de lo que es el World of Color, lo que es con las fuentes. Entonces queremos ver el nuevo show para ustedes antes que lo saquen del parque. Es importante que lleguemos a nuestros tiempos apropiados. They don't have any of Also, um, someone in the chat, I can't remember the name, um, asked for the, the, the mini polka dot, one? polka dot jacket, the jean jacket. Let's go back to the Tommy Hilfiger stuff. Yeah, yeah, we're going to go back to it. It is in the parks. Priced at $79.99. $79.99. Now, we do got to check if it's in World of Color, but it's that bonito. World of Disney, you mean? Oh, I'm sorry. World, world of, of Color? World of yeah, Color world is on my mind. <laughs> That's what's on my mind. I can tell, babe. Clearly, this went up. Looks like it might be good, right, yeah. Speak Life? It looks promising. I hope that it delivers on the storyline. <laughs> but, I mean, it looks fun. It looks like a, definitely like a nice Pixar film. I'm excited to see all the other elements in it. I mean, we like should, earth, I want to see the earth. I want to see how yeah. the earth kind of plays into it all. Right. Yeah. Same here. So vamos, vamos. What's the red dot next to your name? It's you an infinity stone. You should have gotten a gifted membership from one of the fam. Hold on, hold on. Members. It's not Minnie, but I got Mickey. Mickey coming by. Uh, let me get a high five. Mickey, can I have a high five? Oh, Yay, thank Aww, you. We love you, Mickey. Bye, pal. <laughs> okay. We need a drinky drink? Probably, Dave. Probably. But we, but first, the missions. All right. Back into Lies and Company. We, now, if before drawing, we were catching some of the merch. We're going to go ahead and catch the rest of the merch right now. Vamos a ver el resto de la mercancía. So we talked about earlier the ears. 16. Right. I love those ears because they look comfortable. Me duele la cartera. Me duele el codo. Ay. Expensive. Expensive? Let me see the, the jacket looks so good though. I love that jacket. 
The jacket is amazing, but let's talk about this other t-shirt. Aww, I want to talk about the jacket. Because it goes with the hat. The anime Mickey, classic Mickey. Mm -hmm. That is cute. Why can't we draw that? Sería padrísimo. I mean, notes. you have it in the shirt, babe. That, that is true. <laughs> Que más but quieres, the stitching babe. is quality. The stitching, oh yeah, that, that looks That embroidery, like, está padrísimo. Yeah. And the Disney 100 right there. I like that it's two Mickeys. Like, one of the, the Mickeys is looking at the other Mickey. I like that there's, like, that pink, like, uh... Hue? Uh, like the shadow? Well, no, no, because it's, it's threading. So they threaded it across, so it's stitched in. Yeah, but That's it's, what a, I mean, it's, it's quality. It's like, shadow. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, está bonito. What up, birds? Mama bird, how Mama are you? Bird. This is a nice shirt. This is a nice shirt. Yes. The tequila would freaking look so cool in this. All right. $79.90. Dang. You're paying. Wait, you're glossing over the jacket. My bad. Where, <laughs> My bad. I'm in trouble. Where are you going? This is like the most best jacket ever. I love this. You gotta be a real cool kid to go ahead and rock this one. It's $449 of them, the leather jacket that dropped from Marvel. Yeah. Piece. Nicole, I have not seen it online, although I did read somewhere that it might be on t at the Tommy Hilfiger doc uh, site. I don't know if it's okay, on Okay, this is such a quality jacket. Check out the zipper. It even has like this silver Mickey head right here. That is it's cool. It's all about the details. This like slides down very nice. And then it also has those pockets and it's adjustable right here. Oh, with that's that nice. Tommy Hilfiger logo right there on the jersey. Dang, that's cool. Yeah. Every bit of this jacket it's is heavy. quality. It's Heavy. Yeah. Hold on. Is there all oh, that lining? Get out. Dang. Check out this chain right here too. Like it is so cool. I like those jackets so much. And then uh, what I love about these type of jackets is that there is a pocket on the inside. I will see that dentro. That's perfect. All right. So let's go with here. It's on shop Disney. Yay! Thank you Nicole for confirming that for us. I did not get a chance to check the dude, but being at work, like. I love this sweater. Oh my gosh, I like the texture on here. Ta lindo. It this feels is really nice pretty. on what my up, fingers. Like it feels How are like, you, friend? Dang, babe, you might need this one. This it gives me kind really of Louis Vuitton cool. vibes. You know, because the, uh, yeah. the print of the Tommy Hilfiger. $229. Nice. For real? Para esta. But there's not a lot of sweaters that has this texture. No, yeah, that, it's that like is... ridged on the top of it. And the Mickeys are raised. So that's really unique. Oh, we missed a gifted membership. Can you please take a look? Yeah. Thank you, Vintage. Let we'll take a look see. at it right now. No, that need the more than 400. It's 450. Oh, Malibu. Thank you so much. Gifted 1B plus E membership. And it went to, does anyone have where it went to, guys? Hold on, let me see. And it went to Proto Dam. Proto Dam. Oh, enjoy oh my gosh. Thank friend. you so much, Malibu. 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 Hearts in the chat. Hello, Malibu. I like that new like jingle you just made up right Sorry, now. Sorry. <laughs> okay, so with that, that also has pants. Oh, these? No, no, no these. Also, these are pants. And these are not, is it black or is it blue? It it's dark navy. It's dark navy. Hearts in the chat for the Malibu. Okay, so these, dang, it's on the calidad, fam. Oh, yeah. So, Becky and I were talking about the other so day nice. that some, like, some days it's just great day, like, to come to the park in like sweats. These are like fancy sweats. $219 on it, and it has that same like race design for the Mickeys. Ooh. It's the same design from the sweater okay, that so we you, just showed. You can get the pants and the jacket or, or or the sweater, I guess, is what I should call it, or the jacket, right? Dang, these are fancy. These okay. are fly. They look thick, they be thick. They are pretty thick. Thickety thick, like pancakes. You will survive in the in the cold nights. All right, so los shorts, the drawstring shorts, these are nice. They actually read Disney, like the print right there. I don't know if it's coming through. It has a Mickey head and also has the T and the H for Tommy Hilfiger. That's nice. Their newer logo. That's the newer logo. And this is what it looks like on the mannequin. So it looks pretty fly. 149 for those. We drove Stitch, Rodney. We drew oh, Stitch. So one. if you want to go back and rewind just a little bit. So for anyone that's joining in right now, we are so sorry. I know we drove early today. The park closes on this oh side earlier. Oh my gosh. My Heck apologies, Becky's yes. working right here. Um, the, the park is closing a little bit earlier. We wanted to get drawing in because we're going to sketch World of Color because tonight they are premiering a new... Elemental short in front in of the World front of Color. Of it, yeah. But check out this. I love this detail. I told you, dude. Look like, how thick these shoelaces are. They're not shoelaces, but they look like, like thick shoelaces. Isn't that what they're called? Drawstrings? I don't know. Drawstrings, yeah. Not. 
these are cool. It has the Disney 100 on the on them right there. Dude, is, is it 150 bucks? No, this is 189. Okay. I want this just because of this. I mean, yeah. I know it's a male thing, but I'm just gonna wear it. If I, All right, I'll go. Work I don't mind. I'll go work over time. <laughs> no, yeah, I want it too. It's really nice. It's really nice oh, quality. Oh man. But that's one of those sweaters that like like will last you a while. You know what right. I mean? Like as long as you like treat it and wash it properly, like that's it, key right there. That's key. That's key. Right and so like there. that's what we're talking about. Like esta mercancía lo estamos hablando porque está más elevado en precio. Pero la cosa con el detalle de todo eso es que la calidad es más alta. Like the quality really is much more. So that is what you're paying. You're paying for the name, you're paying for quality on it. But it, it's something that you will take care of and it's a staple piece that'll work for you, um, you know, for, for years to come. All right, we're gonna pop in over here to see the munchlings that just oh, dropped today. Please, let's do that. And then we'll make that our way, we'll make our way idea. over to uh, pick a spot for no, pues sí. World of Color. I see, see, like. These are past discount. I don't think that's enough. <laughs> right. But it is a nice piece. All right. Come on. Oh, got it. Go oh, on. thank you, babe. You're welcome. You bro Burr says app. hi. What up, Bro Burr? Bro Burr. <laughs> What's up? Dude, you got to make it down here. You guys are so... We, I know we, we missed we you have guys met, met, We have met... Bro, dude, we have met your whole entire family except you. We got to get you out here in the parks. A ver, a ver, a ver, a ver, a ver, a ver. So... Do they have them here? It's oh. um no. no. What a bummer. That just means the search continues. They need to come out with a backpack or a bag of the Baymax. Agreed. Plus the ears of Baymax. I See. would immediately buy that. And with San Francisco coming through really soon, then we definitely need a lot more Baymax. Mix. I feel like we're gonna get it. I hope we get it. You want to go that way or you want to go this way? I'm checking time. Checking time? Okay. What time is the new... What it's at it's 9 at or 9.30? It's at 9, but you know, 8. With it only being a single show tonight, we're going to have to camp out for it. I think we should probably make our way over there. These cushions are great. They're back in stock for like... Um, la, la, the... the the sofas or the chairs or the lawn chairs? Yeah. That'd be nice. Do a little outside Disney decor. And they're soft. $34.99. Actually, as far as like cushions go, that's not bad. You, you actually end up paying more like, you know, when you go pick them up at like a Bed Bath & Beyond or like even Macy's. So he wants more, yeah. So Disney Lover, the munchies that came out today were different designs. Uh, one of them, they're, they're the hidden packs, but one of them happens to be flower that's in the mix with a few other ones that are in there. So it's really cute. Do you, do you want me to slow down? I'm sorry, I'm no, like zigzagging everywhere. I do apologize. Go for it. Are you sure? Oh yeah, I'm following behind you. Okay, let me open the door for you and then we'll go through. Pardon me guys, give me one second. Let me just make sure Becky doesn't get left behind me. All right, grab my arm. I know you're on that thing. All right, but no, yeah, so with that said, we have a lot of cute little ones. Well, don't worry, we're gonna go over to Disneyland after World of Color and after the fireworks to, uh, to see the rest of the merch. And go on the some rides. The merch, yes. No, yeah. Well, mm, touch touch base on, uh, there's a, on lot. a lot of goodies. Yeah, there's a there's lot. There's also a new Tic Tac Go, a Tic Tac Toe game being sold over at Batu. What? Yeah. I want that. I I want to look at it. I don't want to buy it. <laughs> if it was like if it was like um, uh, Tic Tac Toe for like forty, like then right. I'd be in. And then I'd be in. Give me give me that extra row for it. Battle it out. Let's go look at the Grand Night photo off. Let's stop by it. It's on already. All right. I just like looking at all the photo ops that Disney and Disney California like to bring up for the events. And then are you going to want a drinky drink or we're just going to stand out there like for let an me, hour? Let me park you first Okay. and set up the area and then I can like run over to grab something. Yeah. All right. Grand night photo. Class of 2023. No, that looks amazing. And that's congratulations buddy? to every single um, person that's graduating, whether it's sixth grade, fourth grade, third grade, twelfth grade, whatever grade. We are so proud of you guys. Yeah. And then 100%. Alan, we have grad night going off for like another two weeks. So like, yeah. There are several dates going through. Um, the last week, I believe, of grad night is the week of the yeah. 15th, if I'm not mistaken. 
You want the Jungle Cruise boat with a Doe Whip header? I know, I want that Disney 100 Jungle Cruise boat. It looks amazing. And me and Eli have, what, one. how many versions of that do just we have? Just one, we just, just have one. one. We have the one okay. that came out when we, when the- Then we need that other one to continue it It on. makes no sense to have it. It, it does. It's like we popcorn buckets. Yeah, but better. Yeah, that's true. That's true. <laughs> but better. <laughs> If you come, live at Disneyland, which land backpack. would you live in? What land would I live in at Disneyland? Ooh. It's hard not to say Fantasyland. Batu. But, but as a Star Wars fan, I gotta <laughs> yeah. say Batu. Batu takes it 100% of the way. You get to play with lightsabers, go on rides, and everything else. No! no you know what? I, I, I love Star Wars, but I gotta, I gotta go with Fantasyland. I get the, so, I get the, it's in my pack. You just chose the most packed land. I chose Go the land it. that is the most magical within the last 15 minutes no, of the park closing really. or the first 15 of opening. Oh, with the falcon, it's very magical. <laughs> okay. <laughs> no, sure, big family six. Don't worry. For anyone that's like finishing up their drawings, give us a chance to get over to a spot to park it for, uh, for the show. And then we will begin going from there. Let us just think you got to... Estacionarlos para ver el show. All right. They don't have the elemental music out no, yet. No, huh? elemental music is not out yet. Okay. Yeah, the, the thing with Disney is that Disney doesn't drop their like soundtracks ahead so, of time. Right there, yeah. that moment, right. That's what I was thinking. New Orleans Square, ooh, okay, so let's talk about that Tiana cheese, but some of y'all know this, some of y'all don't know. Um, lo que salió ayer, um, el resuelto de Tiana. Wait, hold on, hold on. Hold on, I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna. So fam? Hey! <laughs> hey. We're on a run. No, we are no, oh, oh, go, go get it, it. go, Godspeed, Enjoy. go guys. <laughs> They, the world's they, fastest they walk as fast as us. <laughs> Dang! They're Don't leave her it. behind! <laughs> Dang, they are on top of okay, it. Okay, so today. this is what I want to show from across. Please, let's show it. Okay, so. If you see back here, the beer truck is gone. Si ven allá atrás, esa pared aquí que, que tengo aquí, estaba la, 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 la troca de cerveza que servía como una cervecería Wait, anteriormente. What, what was it? The beer truck is gone. The beer truck that it is finally officially removed oh, and really? behind it is going to be the meet and greet for Baymax. So that is a great wow. sign that finally we're getting closer to like knocking it out, getting it done. And of course, having the other brewery or like, I'm sorry, the, the Cerveceria being the official spot right there opening up um, for us soon. So that is cool. San Francisco is coming along quite nicely. So, estamos bien con eso. So lo que estoy compartiendo es que anteriormente había una, una troca de cerveza que vendían las cervezas aquí, pero lo han quitado ya oficialmente porque en esa área van a ser el lugar donde uno puede entro a conocer a Baymax, el personaje, y luego al lado van a tener aquí la cervecería que va a reemplazar esto. Pero al fin ya tenemos movimiento que pues nos da gusto porque ya, ya, ya está por llegar el verano. Y dijeron que bueno, eso va a estar listo. Right, oh, yeah. they so, gotta punch it. It's already summer. Well, already. It, it, we're knocking on summer's doors. That, that's what's going on. Remember that they did announce that by summer it would be ready. All right. So with that said, come over here. Let's talk about the Tiana, the Tiana attraction. You want to hit up the notes or shall I continue? The Tiana attraction is going to have its own music in yes. the ride. So that was a big twist. I literally thought that we were going to hear some of the favorites, which I think they... I don't know how I feel about this, but I'm excited for the new music, but I just wanted those hitters in there, so. The bangers? No, yeah, yeah I get you, I get you. bangers. But, you know, uh, but the other thing is we're talking about, we're gonna have 18 characters from the film in that, including. That's a lot of characters, okay. Including uh, Prince Navi's brother in there as right, well. Right, at the Prince, end. Yeah, That's so that'll be crazy. cool. That's crazy. That'll be cool. What do you guys think of the Tiana news that dropped not so long ago? That cute little truck is gone, right, Moses? Yeah. Oh. Now they just have three little tables. Oh, really? It's crazy. Super excited for Tiana. Yes, fam. Definitely. 
Oh. Let's see. Like right here. Yeah, I'm good right here. You can see as long as I can hold it. I know we are ready for we the meet and greet. Probably, I don't know if I'm gonna be able to get it from here. You will. Okay. You'll be fine. I'll put you, I'll put you on the other gimbal. Okay. So let's uh, let me get caught up to the to the chat. Oogie boogie. Oogie boogie. Opening day? Yes. Halloween day for us? Probably not. We're getting, we still gotta not figure out Halloween the second day. night. Mm -hmm. But oogie boogie like dates are out. We have also the pricing for those as well. Um, it starts off like opening day, like I think it might be one of the cheapest days. El evento de Oogie Boogie ya ha se anunciado. Oh yeah, closer um, to Halloween it gets a more pricey. Right, so el primer día es el precio más barato o más precio más razonable. Y cuando llegas ya los últimos días o el fin de los fines de semana. They drop the whole entire information yeah. a week earlier than what we anticipated. Way, well they're selling it way a week earlier than we anticipated too. They're selling so it it's earlier. way like wild in regards to that. You wanna... Uh, so let but me no, see yeah. here. What do you guys think? Are you guys gonna attend Oogie Boogie this year? Yeah. One or two. One or two. One or two. Yeah. So for the first day, it's one thirty-four, and then it goes all the way up to one fifty-nine on their most expensive day. It's like Actually, one. the most expensive is one eighty-nine. One eighty-nine. Yeah. So the 29th and the thirty-first. Yeah. One eighty-nine on that. Almost 200 bucks per person. That's crazy. No, yeah, it's wild. It is utterly wild for it. Yeah, we are going to try to do two nights yeah. for Oogie Boogie Bash. Yeah, I know that we can for sure get the, the first opening day, like no problem, but we got we to gotta figure out number two, so no worries. Number two? No, yeah, but no worries. We'll get it covered for y'all. So that we can show you the characters which have not been released, which ones we're gonna have. I mean, not quite as personalized. Who are you? Who are you speculating that we're gonna get? From new characters that we could have there, I want Abuelita. That would be cool. I want Abuelita. She's Over a, there by this that area. Yeah. That'd be crazy. Hey, Shari, how are you? Hey, oh, Shari. Oh, you so much. Oh, that's Hello, right. Katie, so, welcome. What so, happened? Smoking Keto has a really good point, and thank you so much for sharing this. They're planning on buying the tickets when they go on sale for match key holders, so let's talk about that. There will be a date ahead of everyone else. They can buy them the, the tickets at the end of June. I believe it's 24th. Can you double check when you get a chance? Yeah, I'm going to double check um, right here. I believe it's June 24th, and then I think it's like three days after that non uh, match key holders can go ahead and pick up their tickets. Scott, you guys are planning on going? That's awesome. Are you and Michelle going to come as Jedis? <laughs> <laughs> Thanos for Oogie Boogie would be amazing, Nando. Oh my gosh. Well, the Magic Key Holder says stay tuned for additional details on special, a special oh, offering. Oh, okay, okay. So they didn't release that, but they are going to be releasing that information oh. soon. Wait, Neta? Yeah, that's what it says right there. Magic Key Holders. Oh, 